Right, okay. Hello everyone. Uh, welcome back to Longland in Transport Fever 2. Yeah, this is Longland and we're still messing about with iron uh, mining. Now we haven't flung any trains at any of this yet. I'm not going to just yet. What I need to do, is, uh, let's just uh, let time run. Um, okay, what I need to do is I need to get uh, the train line from the Jericho Iron Collection Station and I need, I need to get it all the way over to the Pork Belly Steel Smelting Station and then I need to get all the way over here. Now I could uh, bring this around down this way and across here and up here or I could bring it up and around this way and then down through here and then across through the middle of everything here and uh, come into here and then from there we head on over to the coal uh, mining over here right uh, that's kind of what I'm thinking um, and that's uh, exactly how we uh, do that it's going to depend on the station here I'm kind of thinking that I want to run the station on this angle here so um, I'm going to go ahead and build a station there. It's going to be a cargo station, 320, no, uh, no catenary. Uh, going to be two platforms because we're going to run through and also because we're going to need to uh, tag up with these other uh, um, industries, right? Uh, so, no, that's not where I want to put that. Uh, right, I'm going to want to have some roads here first, I think. So let's, uh, let's build a, a road here. We got tendrils there, yeah. Um, now this, uh, about the shortest path is about like that. So that gets a tendril there, and this one probably comes in like that. Because we can't get... Oh, can we get a tendril down there? Zoom in so we can see. Um, no, because we've got a collision. Uh, we can get a tendril there. Now let's just see if we can get those to light up with a station. Uh, no. Okay, we can get those two to light up. And, okay, I think we're going to need to do something similar to what we did in the other location. So I'm going to build that there. Now, uh, we're going to configure this, and I'm going to extend the uh, platforms here to their maximum extent. Uh, one, uh, two, yeah. Uh, one, two, three. And we'll do it on both sides. Yeah. I'll deal with the tracks in a minute. Uh, whoops, no. And I need uh, cargo buildings. We'll stick a cargo building off the end here. And we'll stick one off the end here. And then I'm pretty sure we can just clobber this and clobber this. Yep. And then if we do keep that open, we grab a road. Uh, I'm pretty sure we can, yeah, I'm pretty sure if we come across like this, we've got a tendril there, and then if we go like this, we got, okay, good, that connects, and I'm pretty sure if we go across like this, we get tendrils there. And we can come down like this. And that connects. Good. 
Now, just for uh, giggles, we'll uh, uh, put a road. We'll, we'll, we'll uh, finish up the road connection here. Uh, okay. And we can do this. Yeah. Okay. So we've got a thing going on there. Right. Now, if we come in here and we grab the smoothing gun and we amp up the strength and then we do this, uh, we can make this look less egregious. Okay. Uh, that's your idea of less egregious, is it? Yeah, it kind of is. Okay, tracks. Uh, we're going to uh, do this. Okay. And this. Okay. So that means we're definitely coming in from up here. Um, okay, I need to... Wait, there's one more I need to, to get here. I need a cargo building uh, over about here. Yeah, okay. And then we go over to uh, roads. Uh, we'll put one of those like this. And we come in like... Nope. Uh, well, that's got tendrils, so that will do. Yeah. Yeah, so that's all four of those, right? Uh, good. Now, we, we need to come in that way, and that means we're coming in... I think... Yeah, well, I think we'll parallel this up here. Um, but we can come down around this way... Well, it's pretty busy through here. Okay, so if we run the track up through here, we can come around this way. And I think we can easily get across this one. And then we can strike off across this way. Um, hmm... And from here, well, we could come around and down this way and around the bottom of the thing and then, okay, I think, yeah, yeah I know, I'm hemming and hawing. Uh, if I bring it through here, I've got a lot of uh, busy stuff to, to run through. If I bring it down around this way, I just have to cross the one line. Yeah, okay, I think I'm going to do that. Well, either way, I'm going to need tracks. Yep. Uh, yeah, okay. And that means that we kind of come in around this way. Yeah, we kind of do come in around that way. And I need to get over the tracks here. But that... That's a freight line. I can probably do a level crossing on that. Um, okay, so we're going to have to come around this way. Yeah. Uh, and that's going to need one of these. Yeah. Now, how are we going to do this? I need to come this way and then pop across. Um, somewhere around here. Um, yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to parallel, parallel that for a little bit here. And then, yeah, zoom in, parallel it a little bit. Yeah. Do this. Now. Uh, do I have uh, track construction? I do have the uh, flying junctions. I could possibly stick a flying junction in here. Yeah. Okay. So, um... 
our trap okay our uh tunnel height we'll make it 12 meters just because we want a huge okay no radius on the lower track upper track radius no crossing angle um yeah no that's probably too tight crossing angle yeah that's about a good angle yeah because we're gonna put have that running through there roughly like that okay yeah uh radius whoa okay yeah okay i think that's about what i want okay well Nope. Well, I'm going to have to kill this uh, track for a short distance here. And I'm going to need to rail track. Uh, back that up, of course. And then make this straight and level. Right like that no I just need the one so that the uh, so that this will uh, snap to it yes good that snapped to it okay and then tracks this comes up to here right and then this will uh, connect up like that and that will connect up like that and we can let the trains continue okay now can, can that get can this get uh up to here uh how far down do we have to go uh okay Okay, now do I have to adjust this for a lower, okay, I could go lower on that, um, okay, uh, track construction. Tunnel height. Yeah, I think that's probably... Yeah, that's probably better. Okay, now. Uh, tracks. Uh, we can go... Yeah... The smoke going through it is kind of weird, but uh, uh, now the question is how can we get too much slope? Well, that gets down. I think we can get this up to about, I think we can get it up to about here. Uh, no, no. Uh, you. Come on, snap. Okay, you. Aha, that works. Okay, that is. Uh, what are you doing? Okay. 
Okay, that gets us over. Good. That's exactly what I needed there. And now we won't have any conflict point, right? And that, that was the goal there. No conflict point, because these are going to be long, slowish trains, right? Uh, okay, so yeah, we can bring that one down like that. Okay. Well, there we go. That's a uh, that's a flying junction. And off we go. We will parallel this for a distance. Uh, that distance will be some distance. Yeah, we got to get through here and then we'll bend around the uh, nose of this this thing here and up through here. Okay, so how are we going to need to build this? Well, we can build it in chunks like this. And in case you're wondering, definitely the four tracks are going to be needed here. Just because of the volume of transport that's going to be going on. Even with more modern trains as they... Ooh. That's going to be in the way. Hmm... Okay, well, let's see. Can I can sneak that one through. Okay, can I sneak this one through? Oh, I can sneak it through. Okay. Yep, it goes through. Good. And we got to go past the other one. Uh, okay. This track might end up supporting the uh, oil industry as well. Uh, okay, now from here... I can back you up one track length. Yeah. And then around here, we can go around the nose of the, the ridge. Just like that. Okay. That's good. And we want to just strike up this way. Uh, we want to head that way. Okay. Well, there's the snap point for straight. There's another snap point for straight. Then we can come around this way and around this way. Good. So we can bring this one also along. Uh, up that way. Good. Now, we need to bring the track into here. Again, continue around the hill. And then from here, we should be able to just bounce in. Yep. Okay. And again, this should just bounce in. Well, that's uh, that's gone pretty well. Now, from here, we need to get across to here, and we're going to end up coming along... Um, yeah, we're going to end up coming along... Uh, okay, so I think... I think we need to just bridge across here. Uh, okay, can we... Oh, I think this is high enough. Yeah, I think it is. Okay. Well, could we just peel off of here and then bridge across the station? I wonder. Well, let's put a track here and then see what we can do. Uh, if we come across level, that's not the bridge I want. What about that one? That looks dangerous. Yeah, it kind of does. What about this one? Well, I suppose, yeah, we could use Jolly Green. Yeah, that, that would uh, that would work. Okay. 
And then this, we can get bridge pillar collision. Um, we can actually, oh, we can get across. Okay. I think that's workable. Do we get a bridge pillar? Ooh. I kind of like that. Okay. Now, we need to uh, punch this down onto here. I like it. This here, though. Yeah, that's what we'll do there. Okay, I like it. Okay, that turned out to be less uh, problematic than I thought it would be. Okay, so that gets us up through here, and then we can parallel this track. Yeah. Okay, so we come up to here, and then we come... I don't want that. Um, so we're going to come to here. Can we not snap that? Um, no. Okay, we're going to grab this like that. Yeah, let's do that. That looks less bad. Okay. Well, that does give us this nonsense here, but uh, I think that's less bad. Uh, okay. Now, uh, I'm going to four-track this as well, just because of transport volumes again. Uh, this uh, line is going to take long, slow trains. And I don't want that to interfere with the other long, slow trains, etc. Nope, wrong one. Okay, so we come around. Well, we can snap to there. We can snap to there. We can get rid of that. Uh, we can come around here, right? Okay. Right, we're getting past the town here of Cityville. Okay, we can snap to there. Good, we got that. And that. We didn't demolish anything doing that. No, if we did, I didn't notice it. Uh, okay, that can come along here. Good. And then we've got to come all the way past Lake Wobegon. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to have some fiddling that we have to do up the road a bit. Uh, where does that snap to? Well, that will snap there. Yeah. Do that. Good. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, okay, there, there, yeah, up to there, yeah. Okay, so when we come up to this, uh, this here, we need to look at some other pathing through there. Yeah, because we're going to have to pop over this. Which here looks like the promising place to do that. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm going to work backward from here now. Now this, yeah. Yeah, we obviously... No. What? Okay. We're going to want to come across on about that angle. Too much slope. Yeah, okay, we'll have to go up a bit. That will work. Um, you know, we're using Jolly Green. Let's do that. Okay. So that comes across there. And then we're going to have to bypass around Lake Wobegon. So 
this is going to uh, yeah it's going to do that okay and it's going to come around on this angle yeah just like that and then on to here yep okay well that'll get the connection point there uh, a little wobbly but uh, you know it'll be fine uh, we need the track to come around like this good then we need to come uh, we need to come down to this track here um, can we get down that far uh, can we do that this way? Uh, down. Okay. Now, can we get in this way? We can! Um. Right. I think that will, uh, that will be acceptable. I'll have to rebuild that bridge. I think this comes down this way. Really? I don't have to rebuild the bridge? Well, I'll take it. Uh, the other bridge I probably will. I uh, come around. I don't? I'll take it. I didn't expect that to go that easy. I was expecting to have to do some sort of uh, complicated engineering there. Right. Okay. And now we just need to connect the track up. Right. And that just means building a couple of segments here. And bam. Well, that's the track between the smelting operations. Um... So this would be the Lake Wobegon uh, smelters. Yep. Right. Okay. Now, the next bit is going to be getting over to the coal and collecting the coal. So that's going to be a bit more of what we've just been doing at the other end. But we've got this long train line plumbed in. And then this will have to come out of here and do something. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll figure that out next time. Now, we've done enough for this time. We've got the, uh, the long-distance lines in there uh, for two-thirds of it, I guess. And next up, we'll be getting the trains going for the uh, coal, or the lines going for the coal. Uh, I imagine that's going to be two, maybe three parts. Yeah, it's... Uh, quite a complicated uh, process getting all of this online and then once we've done that we'll have to actually get the steel going somewhere yeah and that's going to uh, take a little bit of uh, finagling as well so uh, yeah we've got uh, we've got some work cut out for us still and once we get the steel done then we've got the uh, we've got the oil chain to finish as well and I think that will finish all of the industry and then we can look at, uh, you know, balancing things a bit more, upgrading tracks, things like that, upgrading trains. And I think it will end up uh, getting to the point where we can do inter intercity passenger services and stuff like that. That will be that will be able to pay off. Uh, I'm hoping to get to the point where we can do like a Shinkansen or something like that. But, you know, it's hard to say. Uh, I might get bored with this or the map might implode or something like that. It hasn't yet. Um, yeah, uh, so that's uh, progress. And we've, and you know, this new uh, train line that we put in hasn't added that much extra to the uh, map. Uh, although, uh, that is quite a lot of train stuff crisscrossing everywhere, isn't it? Yeah, it kind of is. Anyway. Uh, that's, uh, that's going to be all for this time. So, you know, like, comment, subscribe, that business, right? Uh, or hit dislike if you prefer. I mean, people do that, so why not? 
And of course, the bell thing may or may not get you some notifications that may or may not be useful. You know, it's entirely up to you. That said, see you back next time.